The most important part of the bee twist is the set. Once you can coordinate the set, this move is extremely simple. Most important part of the set is coming up, where you do the U-shaped dip. If you do the dip right, you will have all the power you need. This is the position you should be in as you jump, simultaneously turning and driving your heel up. If you coordinate all that correctly, you should have all the height and momentum you need to complete the B-twist. The U-shaped dip equals height, so focus on getting it right. Coordinating your rotation and heel drive is what's going to make your B-twist parallel. Pay attention to how I coordinate that U-shift dip with the heel drive and torque to complete my B-twist. From this angle you can better see the coordination of the dip and drive as I jump. I cannot stress enough how important it is that you coordinate all these elements together so that you can complete this movement. Put all of that together and you should have a nice B-twist. There are a couple problems I'm going to address now that may keep you from getting the B-twist. The first is heel drive. Too much and you just whip around kind of like a weird front flip. And with too little heel drive you won't even get parallel. So what you have to do is find the balance in your heel drive so that you can get a nice parallel twist. Another problem people may have is with the dip. The whole thing about it is if you don't dip, you won't get height. So really work on getting this part perfect. Remember to coordinate all these things and you should have a B twist in no time.